Welcome to this demonstration of a Power BI report created by Enterprise DNA. Today we have a scenario and some data simulated for a transportation company that receives bookings from a variety of clients through a number of different channels. The time frame of the, the data spans for five months and is located throughout New Zealand uh, at all major cities and towns. The report is broken up into five different parts, five different pages. We have a summary page of all key business metrics. We have the data analyzed spatially um, on the map of New Zealand. We then have analysis around the channel and type of client bookings. Also loyalty and client groupings. And finally, some analysis on age, gender, and passenger types. So the first page here on bookings allows an executive or management to analyze key business metrics, in, including profit margins, bookings, sales, discounts, new customers, etc. Through the, the linking of the data model behind the scenes, you are able to interact with these charts by clicking through and drilling into uh, different key metrics of uh, the, da the data. So here, for instance, we are looking at the total bookings that have come, or total sales rather, that have come through the web. And we can then see the makeup of total sales distributed throughout the country, um, New Zealand in this particular case. We jump over to some of the location analysis. <laughs> this enables us to intuitively analyze our data from a spatial perspective. Um, here, for instance, we can just navigate to Auckland, New Zealand's biggest city, and analyze all the bookings per client grouping. So the darker uh, black are uh, for the retail clients and the aqua is for corporate. And still here we can actually drill down into a particular month if we like. Um, if we wanted to look at current month, there is that, not as many, not, not that many. Um, but for, we can filter here but then also jump across to the direct, what type of destination was asked uh, for in the booking and for instance we can go to airport and then we're able to look at uh, trends through throughout the rest of the data. Jumping over to channel and type, similar look and feel here where we have the filters on the side and our data summarized in pie charts up the top. These enable you to then to filter these charts below and also the map. Loyalty and client groupings. Again, we have all of our key business metrics summarized in various different visualizations, which we can then manipulate to get to our desired insight. Finally, we can jump to age, gender, and passenger type and filter on those particular uh, metrics and all the charts are dynamically linked um, for us to work around the analysis. <laughs> 